Hey there booktube, welcome back to my channel, I'm Run Right, and today I'm going to share with you the 8 books I added to my shelves in May, so stick around for my May book haul. I bought two non-fiction books and I got one from the publishers to review. The first was the one I got from the publishers. This is The Power of Broke by Damon John. I requested it from Blocking for Books because I wanted to see what this rich man had to say about being broke. In the book, he shares his story of making it. He started off as a young teenage entrepreneur in Queens, New York, and he encourages people who are just starting out as entrepreneurs to use the power they have at their disposal. That drive to succeed that comes from the hunger and desperation you only have when you're broke. a blog where I talk about running and other things but I recently started a challenge to run more frequently and one of the things I do to keep me motivated is to read books about runners and this is one of my favorites Born to Run by Christopher McDougall not to be confused with a similar book by Scott Jurek called Eat to Run which is another one of my favorites I've read both of them before from the library but I bought this one to reread it for running inspiration this one focuses on the way some cultures support running, like the distance runners that come from some parts of Africa. Altogether, it's a pretty dense read, but I plan to be running for a long time, so I need lots of running mojo. And Longevity is the second health book that Cameron Diaz has released. The first one was called The Body Book, and I've read both of them before as well, but this one has great information that is specifically for women who are approaching middle age. And I got this one from the thrift store because I saw it on sale and I couldn't resist, so I bought it. So those are my three non-fiction acquisitions, The Longevity Book by Cameron Diaz, Born to Run by Christopher McDougall, and The Power of Broke by Damon John. On to my fiction buys, of which there were five. One was free from the publishers and the others were bought or received as gifts. First up is Run by Anne Patchett. I bought another book by this author recently and I haven't read either of these two yet, so they're on my upcoming TBR, which I'll talk about in my next video. I bought a used copy of Where'd You Go, Bernadette by Maria Semple because I'm reading it with one of my students. I started reading this book when it was first released and I think I DNF'd it back then. Having someone to discuss it with this time will push me to read it, so hopefully I like it better this time. I requested this copy of Hag Seed by Margaret Atwood from the publishers. This is the latest installment in the Shakespeare retelling series that Hogarth Publishers is doing and last month I bought this hardcover copy of Hag Seed but I really wanted to own this paperback edition also because I'm trying to collect the series with these cool covers. See I already have the Shylock retelling in that edition. And then speaking of Margaret Atwood, her Handmaid's Tale has gotten quite a popularity surge since Hulu released an adaptation of the story and my friend gifted me with this beautiful hardcover edition of the novel which I am so looking forward to reading. And last but by no means least, especially since this is a heft of a novel, I bought a copy of The Casual Vacancy by J.K. Rowling. I'm not a big fan of the Harry Potter series. I read one book and I haven't felt a desire to read the others, but I do want to become a fan of J.K. Rowling's writing. So I plan to read something by her this year and this purchase will help keep me accountable to that goal. So those are the eight books that I acquired in May, five fiction books and three non-fiction. So three serious and five fun. That's a good mix, I think. But just to be sure, let's see if we can arrange them in rainbow colors because that makes everything fun. Thanks for watching this video. I hope it won't be so long until the next one. But until then, happy reading. Bye.